and I just realized that everything I just recorded was completely wrong because I recently fixed OBS of something and it broke everything and all of the footage is shrunken. Oh, look at that. Sky looks really cool though. Oh, wait, it's oxidized beyond the first stage. Yes, <laughs> this is great. This is great, everything's going great. How, how are we doing? How are we doing on kelp? How are we doing? How are we doing on bamboo? Ooh, we got lots of bamboo actually. Is the wandering trader still here? Uh, sir. All right. That is a disgusting sound. I have a farmer. I, I was finally sick of having like stacks upon stacks of excess um, potatoes, and I figured I put it to good use. So now I have a farmer, and he is already master level because I already have pumpkin farm and potato farm. And obviously I'll get more of these guys um, and I'll probably be curing, infecting slash curing some of them. Uh, I do have blaze rods, right? I visited the nether, so I should have blaze rods. I have all the stuff I need for potion making, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, and I finished the factory. Well, I'm I'm not quite done yet. Um, I got the roof done, and that was definitely the uh, the most significant part I needed to finish. But I still have to build the inside real quick. Do I have those blocks here? I think that's a visual glitch. <laughs> um. All right then. So this gives me perfect access to this so I can bow meal it whenever I want. Now I'm done with the, uh, the factory. That should be it completely finished. No ifs, ands, or buts. All right. And I should be able to get some XP out of this. Let's see how much it is. Wow. That is rather disappointing. Did I spend all that time on something that's basically completely worthless? You want no, you know what? No, 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 no. It's not worthless. It's not worthless. I'm getting, I'm getting kelp, I'm getting kelp and bamboo out of this. It's not worthless. I'm getting, I'm getting some decent stuff out of it. Yeah, yeah, it's not worthless. I'm getting, I'm getting kelp and bamboo out of that. I don't need to make a farm for either of those two things. And I also have 36 levels, which means I can do some enchanting. Why are you, and why is your arm white? Do not land on my crops. Yeah, this is what happens whenever you stomp on my crops. Silk touch, I will take that. I'm breaking three. Fortune. I'm not going to, actually, let's try my bow. My sword, sweeping edge three, power three. We'll go sweeping edge. Bad, 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 bad. Let's go with efficiency, efficiency four. We will combine it with this pickaxe and make an actually decent pickaxe. That is, that is the goal. All right, we'll do that. No. 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 You will never escape. Never. No. I feel like I should be doing something that allows me to put my emeralds to good use. So what if I got a mending villager? That'd be... A, that'd be a good idea, I think. 
I don't think I've shown this to you guys yet either. I augmented augmented the iron farm, so now it just dispenses them. And then it goes through here. Isn't it great? So I want a mending villager, but I also don't want to have to pay don't want to have to pay full price for said mending stuff. But I also don't have brown mushrooms. Which is necessary for fermented spider eyes, for weakness potions. And I do not believe I have any. What is the fastest way of getting fermented spider eyes? Actually, wait, no, I can just go to the uh, woodland over here. That would be intelligent, wouldn't it? Alright, I got all the mushrooms I need. I just need to make a little cozy little area for them. And you know what? I think this is perfect for now. Well, I got a new mod and I'm curious what it looks like here. Yeah, that's so cool. I also got a mod called Soul Fired, which apparently adds a bunch of soul fire enchantments to the game and makes it so that if you get caught on fire with soul fire, it actually catches you on fire blue. Do I have any soul sand? See, there's actual blue fire. Oh gosh, I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Oh. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I've made something at least semi-functional. <laughs> zombie. I require a zombie. Oh, zombie. Need you to take these. Need you to take these. Alright, you are unhelpful. Stop it! Alright, one of you be able to hold stuff. Are none of you able to hold stuff? Alright, can you hold stuff? Just give me a zombie that can hold stuff. Yeah, I, I'm not- I'm not asking for much here, am I? I don't think I'm asking for very much. The sun has li is literally rising. I've spent 10 minutes on this. All right, guys, it's your time to shine. One of you hold items. Neither of you hold items. Frick you, frick off, get out of here. So that's gonna be for my mending villager. I need to make a place for him to stay though. I could make a boat for him. I could make a boat for him. I did have a design for the boat in mind that I could use. But I didn't really like it. So I'll probably just yolo it. And it's nighttime now, so let's go find a zombie, shall we? You can hold stuff. You can hold stuff. You can hold stuff. Yes! Now you're nine times more dangerous. You can hear your friend up in there? Yeah, that's this that's a similar fate to what you're doing. But this time you actually get to attack the villagers. You don't have to just stare at them longingly. Doesn't that sound great, my friend? I'm sure you're very excited for your new job. Uh, a bright future ahead of you in, in this career. And I understand this career is a very uh, prosperous one. Uh, a lot of new jobs on the market recently. Uh, that guy over there is one, one example, you know. Went from zero uh, requirements of designated villager terrifiers to to two believe it or not um which was a infinity times increase it was it was actually pretty incredible how quickly the economy uh started desiring people like you in the workforce come on down come on down i believe in you you can do it ah Ah, I'm dead. Oh. That's not good. Ever got the axes can take down shields even when in the hands of zombies. He destroyed me. Holy cow. I guess I was only wearing iron armor. Oh my gosh, does that mean he has full armor and diamond tools now? 
Does that mean he has my diamond sword? Does he have my diamond sword? Or my diamond axe? Because if he does, I have to kill him. Or he just disappears. Man, what a flaker. I thought he really wanted the job. You! Would you like a job? Now, sir, we have to make sure you have the necessary qualifications first. You do not. Hmm. But you know what? I can work with you still. Zombification device 2000 is up and ready. Sugar cane. Sugar cane. I need some sugar cane. That is exactly the amount I need. I need one for the sugar and one for making more sugar cane. Yes, 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 yes. Nice. I am. I I have a local brewery that. Yep. Another block is oxidized. It will become oxidized eventually, and it will be glorious. Go. Go, my child. Now, my friend, that may have looked unpleasant, but trust me, it's going to be great for me. So I just have to sit here for a bit. They're done cooking. They're done cooking. They are done cooking. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, I think I think I'm just gonna build the boat now. It's time to build the boat. But I don't know how big I should make the boat. Ew, gross rotten flesh. You know what? That is That's good. That's good. I'll take that. I couldn't believe I was giving a puny villager his own boat. Ha ha! Alright, I can keep doing this until you give me... Until you give me mending. MENDING! Give me that, sir. You have earned your freedom. Just kidding. You will always and forever work for me. I may have to require an entirely new farm. I mean, I guess I don't need a sugarcane farm. No, I do, because I'm going to need books anyways. But I also need redstone to do that, because that's how much redstone I have. And I'm also going to need to go get quartz. Approximately 10 hours later. OK, I spent a long time getting 30 pistons, observers, and redstone dust. And the good thing is I actually have quite a bit of spare from every, all of the mining that I did. And, um, I also found a bunch of copper and also far the music disc, music disc far. Beautiful. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going to put the farm. And I also do not have enough sugar cane. So I have two pieces of sugar cane just kind of sitting there. Um, what should I do now? If I just remove this entire hill here, that would make things much easier to work with, and then it would just slowly go up to that point. That's an idea. I mean, I don't know if it's I don't know if it's a good idea, but it's certainly an idea. I think some action needs to be taken though before I start to uh, dig out that. And I think it involves uh, enchanting the shovel and then enchanting it again because I want at least them breaking on it. Oh, yes, that's actually really good. Um, I mean, for it not being a level 30 enchantment, it's pretty good. It's not perfect, obviously. It's not even unbreaking three, but it is significantly better than all the iron shovels would require. I think I think it's gonna be worth doing. Let's do a time lapse.
I spent way more time doing that than I thought I would. Jeez. I gotta have lots of this. Oh. Oh. This iron farm is way more effective than I thought it would be. So now I have a, a really nice area, honestly. I have a, it's, it's pretty well segmented off. Got this road here, which looks nicer with shaders than it would without shaders, not gonna lie. But then it kind of just goes off to this regular dirt path to go to the pumpkin farm and to the starter house, which is all well and good. And it also goes down all the way down here which that sugar cane is growing, by the way, all the way down here to this XP factory. I feel like I should name you. I feel like I should name you because you're going to be here for a while, right? I feel like I feel like you should you should have a name. It, it, let me know. Let me know what this guy's name should be in the comments. Eh? Uh, that That's 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 the viewer's job for this episode. Name this guy. Name, name him. Give him a name. I'm thinking that this is where I'm going to put the sugarcane farm. I think, I think this is going to be its location. Um, it'll be a pretty nice spot for it, actually. So I think, I think this is going to work. Oh, this would actually be really cool for a, uh, for a house here. Imagine having a big farmhouse here. And then it, it's just up here overlooking all of its farmland with a windmill like right there or something or, or maybe over there oh that's an idea have it fill in there all of that is wheat farm that would be kind of cool actually yes yes this is this is brilliant Look at that. Look at how many bricks I just got. <laughs> oh my gosh. And I also just realized that I can literally double. Like if I mine some clay and I want to turn it into bricks without just buying it, I can literally double the amount of bricks that I get out of a certain amount of clay. Nope. Nope. Sucks to suck. 16 emeralds goes to 40 bricks? That's so good. You, my friend, are going to become a great ally of mine. I can feel it. I'm actually going to build the farm itself real quick. Ooh, and the sugar cane is starting to grow. How much will I have if I break all of it? 20. Not quite enough to fill the entire farm, but enough to get it filled enough. I hear a baby zombie. Ah! That actually looks pretty good. I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited to see how this is gonna get finished. Oh, we have sugar cane. We've got our first sugar cane from the sugar cane farm. Aha! That's a pretty good sugarcane farm. I'd say that this was pretty successful. This was a very, very productive episode. We got this uh, sugarcane farm pretty much done. Just need to do some touch-ups uh, visually, but other than that, it's pretty much done. And we've got, of course, the glorious villager. Oh, some of it's fully oxidized. Look at that. 
Look at that. Some of it's fully oxidized. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's absolutely glorious. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. But we have this amazing men mending villager. Excuse me, why did you go to two emeralds? Because I haven't traded with him in a while, hasn't it? Isn't it? Yeah, it's still fine. Still a very, very good price. And I'm not going to cure them any more than once. So if you all enjoyed, I'd very much appreciate it if you'd subscribe and leave a like on the video. And also comment what the villager should be named. Because I, I honestly have I have, I have no idea what I should name him. So I, I need some ideas. But uh, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye.